Will these hillside homes collapse on the neighborhood below? How safety concerns being raised tonight in the hills of West Oakland have presented a problem. This is ABC 7 News at 6. Their time is just flat running out. Their properties slowly collapsing. An Oakland Hill literally sliding beneath them and threatening more homes below. The city has now officially ordered them to fix the problem. ABC 7's Willie Monroe has been monitoring this mess for us. He joins us live from Wallace Street in Oakland. Willie? Well, P, the hazard abatement notice went out yesterday ordering the owners of the properties to f that are sliding down the hill to fix the problem, whatever it takes. The ground under the three buildings continues to move too slowly to really see, so city building officials took action. At this point, we noticed all the property owners to abate the hazard and give us an engineer's report and determine whether the building, they're gonna demolish the building and so on here. The order was just another blow to Jason Griffin, who's in danger of losing everything. Basically, I've been hiring people to come out and look at it and tell me if it's worth fixing, and most of the people have told me no, so currently I'm just waiting on the insurance company to tell me if they're gonna pick up the responsibility that I feel that they should be picking up, and um, basically that's what I'm waiting for. Um, I, I'm really bouncing back and forth between houses. I don't have anywhere really to stay right now. I'm just basically waiting on them hoping that I don't lose everything. James Gong, who owns three houses at the bottom of the hill, had his own soil engineer examine the slowly moving mud. It's already damaged his backyards and threatens his houses. I'm, con I'm, con I'm concerned who's going to pay to remove the mud. Because right now uh, the house is not in danger at all. He says one estimate is as much as half a million dollars. Insurance investigator Kevin Dawson says the insurance issue is complicated. As you read the policy in a black and white, they say we don't cover land movement, subsidence, earth movement, uh, soils erosion. But there are a lot of factors, complex factors in an investigation. And if those factors, once discovered, lead to a conclusion that the slide was not the cause of the loss, but a result of a covered cause of loss, it could be covered. City officials have already retained people to cut down the trees in the slide area, and they're prepared to demolish the houses if the homeowners don't act fast enough. Of course, they'll send them the bill. Not a good situation for anybody involved. Reporting live in Oakland, Willie Monroe, ABC 7 News.